hello everyone welcome back to my channel if this is your first time on my channel welcome today i am making coconut candy i'm gonna show you how to make coconut candy with condensed milk believe it or not this snack is a very popular snack it is an international snack every culture has a way of making this snack it is quite simple and easy i'm gonna be showing you how to make it with condensed milk i am using only four ingredients i'm gonna leave the list in the description box first i'm gonna start by toasting the coconut flakes i'm using unsweetened coconut flakes i'm gonna toast it the reason why i'm toasting it if you don't toast it it's gonna look like macaroons it's not gonna look like uh, coconut candy so i'm trying to create that dark brown coconut candy color that's why i'm toasting it so this is how you toast it you just put it on an empty pan turn on the heat and start toasting remember you have to stir it move it around it's not easy to stir it that's why i'm using two spatulas to make sure i can toss it properly so that they will have an even color I will continue to toast it until I get my desired color while I am toasting let me use this opportunity to welcome those seeing my video for the first time welcome to my channel please subscribe to my channel click the subscribe button turn on your notification bell invite your friends share the video like it thanks and god bless you special shout out to all those that have subscribed thank you so much god bless you you guys are the best you guys are amazing thank you so much in case you are wondering if you could use fresh coconut yes you could use fresh shredded coconut just toast it the same way when i get my desired shade of brown i'm gonna stop toasting it i'm gonna spread it out to cool while it is cooling down i will go ahead to start cooking down the condensed milk i will be using a can of condensed milk i'm gonna leave the measurement in the description box so i'm gonna pour the condensed milk into the pan and start cooking it down i want to reduce the moisture because condensed milk is made up of milk and sugar so i want to cook cook down uh, the condensed milk so that it will be mostly the sugar that is left i just added a pinch of salt salt balances the taste of sugar whenever you add a little bit of salt to anything that has a lot of sugar it balances the taste and it and it's tastier So I'm going to add about a tablespoon of ground ginger. This is totally optional. You can skip this if you don't like ginger, but if you like ginger, why not? You can also use any flavor of your choice. It actually takes a while for it to uh, cook down. When it's done, it's gonna look more like a caramel. And it is very important to keep stirring it. You have to babysit it. This, this is not something you're gonna walk away from. As you can see, it has reduced considerably. It is very thick and ready for the coconut flakes so i'll be adding the coconut flakes the toasted coconut flakes gradually if you are still watching the video and you are yet to subscribe please subscribe 
like it if you have already subscribed please like the video and share it thank you god bless you i'm gonna continue to add the coconut flakes until i'm done then i will cook it down until it doesn't look too wet uh, and it's like sticky the way uh, the regular coconut candy is you know when you cook the regular coconut candy the syrup is not runny sticks together with the coconut flakes this is what i want so i'm gonna take it off heat i'm gonna start scooping it so i'm using two spoons to scoop it it's still very hot i'll just scoop it and put it on the parchment paper and let it cool i'm gonna continue until i'm done Now that I'm done and they are not really as hot as before, with a clean hand, I'm going to press it into shape like this. See? They look circular. Or you could still roll it too if you want it to be very smooth. You could roll it between your palm with a clean hand like this. See? but it is prettier when it looks so rugged so let's see what we did is that not coconut candy for you the color the stickiness that's perfect coconut candy so because it is sticky i like to wrap it in this candy wrap so that when i put them in a jar like this they don't stick together i want you to give this recipe a try it is very delicious it is milky it is sweet and it has that little kick or spice so thank you guys for watching till i see you next time stay safe stay blessed i love you bye